What is up everybody and welcome back to more Let's Play Pixelmon. So it has been a uh, day, I don't know why wow, time matters, actually it hasn't really been all that long. But what we do have is some iron, I did do some mining and also I should place a torch down because it is very very dark. But yeah, as you can see I have um, all assortments of goodies here, so that is always exciting. And uh, what we can do is actually start crafting some stuff. So what I'm going to do first is create an anvil as today. What I think I'm going to do is I finally decided I'm going to be a gym leader. And I decided that last episode. But what type of gym leader I'm going to be is... Insert name here. I don't know. You guys didn't really come to a uh, decisive decision, I guess, uh, for a weird way of wording things there. But um, in the comments, I basically, you guys suggested I could do this, I could do this, I could do this. And basically, everyone kind of agreed that either a, um, whatchamacallit, a, here, let's actually smelt some stuff, though. So we'll use wood to do this, and we'll actually no, we could use coal for you. Where is the coal? Actually, no, we have no coal, so we'll use wood uh, because there's tons of wood. So we could just put a few pieces. Oh God, no, not that much. <laughs> um, but yeah, so we could put a few pieces of coal in there and get some of you. But basically, what you guys did uh, say was that either a flying, uh, I got like one flying, I got a one grass, I got one fire. A shiny and a bunch of dragon so dragon is just there's like two dragon pokemon in this mod so far and so people are like oh well you could use pokemon that aren't dragon I, I don't i don't know i don't really want to do that it's too not fun i don't know so uh i, I mean there's a water type pokemon gym leader i could be again um i, I don't know it is very dis I, like i don't really know what to do to be honest so what we do have is um some apricorns i think what i'm going to try and make is a dusk ball so if i remember how to make that here's a cooked green apricorn and i think i need to uh, make white ones too or it was a black oh crap i forget now so let's try black in this one and um we'll see which one works out and then we'll see which one doesn't work out i mean obviously only one is going to work out in the end but uh yeah so that is what i want to do today and go try and catch some pokeball or go catch some new pokemon for the pokemon or for the uh gym i am going to have which is i don't know <laughs> I, it's so like i'm like uh, i don't I, I really don't know but dust pokeballs actually seemed like a pretty awesome thing so how long has it been since i've done this am i doing this wrong wait how do i do this again i forget uh Wait, oh yeah, no, 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 I'm doing it right, it just takes an, I don't remember it taking this long. Do I have to keep going? Oh god, is it because I'm using an al aluminium one? Wow, this is so slow compared to what I remember. Jesus. And there's one. My god, this is slow. I appear, I guess, did I, I used to have a diamond one, I think, or something like that. So maybe something we should go get is diamonds. And what I think I should do is try and set up the town a little bit more today and um, figure out what kind of town theme I'm going for, and then maybe take on a few residents and charge them rent so I could go um, get some diamonds and trade for things in that sense. And also, someone else did suggest that I turn down the opacity to my chat over just turning it off completely. So I did do that and I turned it down very very low as you can see so we have black I think it's black not white so let's try this and um, I imagine it would be like this and if you put the two black and yes yeah, so dust ball disc so um yeah I guess I will do this now and we can just make a whole bunch of ball lids and stuff like that I'll come back after I do this because this seems very very repetitive to watch and um someone said my name so yeah I'll be back my god that was horrible like, that, that was literally, like, five minutes of just smashing things with this. And luckily, halfway through, I did remember that I'm going to need buttons uh, again. So luckily, if I didn't remember that, we would have been in a deep doo-doo because I would have all these things and have to smelt something. But luckily, we do have dust balls, which, oh, okay. And uh, basically, I looked at what dust balls did, and they seem to be freaking fabulous, um, for lack of a better word. And basically, what dust balls do is they will... Um, Actually, here, let's see what else we can create. I think I could, can I create a love ball, or do I need another pink one for a love ball? Um, I mean, there's, there's, I, we're obviously only going to need two of each to find what we need. But is a love ball like this? Are these cooked? 
Oh no, the, the pinked one's not. Pink one isn't cooked. So we could cook that really fast and find out. But um, yeah, so I don't know. I forget uh, what. I, I, I never really knew most of those recipes, but that might be a love ball. I know we could make a. No, we can't make a. We can make an ultra ball, I think, but we can only make one, and I don't, I'm poor right now, so, but there is that, and alright, so here we have a cooked pink apricorn, and, but love balls are good, because they could get increased happiness on Pokemon, and yeah, so see, we can make, oh no, that's a heal ball, so when you catch it, it will heal the Pokemon right away, so that's kind of cool, but um, I'll put the rest a, away for now, and we have um, a few more, I, I don't need those right now, uh, but basically what the Dusk Balls do, which it, it's like a three times higher chance to catch a Pokemon at nighttime, or something like that, but uh, I was reading them, and apparently they're really good, so I thought that was cool, and every time I see uh, one of these guys now, I laugh, because at one of the earlier episodes, since it was like so bright, abstract, and shiny, uh, and most Pokemon aren't like that, I thought the Weedle was shiny, so, and then I was like, oh my god, the shiny Weedles are everywhere, but in fact, it's not, that's just the way it looks, but yeah, so, obviously, I only want to use these at nighttime, otherwise, I think it's just a regular Pokeball, but still, pretty good, so I'm happy to have that, and I think that's it, right? We did, uh, some mining, here's some temporary skin, <laughs> um, maybe I should put on some pants, um, we could do that, we could, we could do that, so, <laughs> uh, it'll, uh, clean things up a little, and here, yep, so now I just have a belly button, <laughs> um, so yeah, so basically what I'm going to do now, I did some, a mill tank, have I ever caught one of you? I don't know, it's, well, it's not nighttime, so that's the only thing that kind of sucks, is, um, <laughs> I have all these dusk balls, and they're not going to be very helpful until nighttime, but what we can do is kind of figure out where I want to go with my town, uh, obviously, I, I think I can, uh, does juice battle on Fridays, I'll just say that, um, and, ooh, there's a, uh, trainer, gym leader dude right here, train, okay, he is, uh, I always thought that was a Pokemon, I remember during my, why am I having all these nostalgic moments, I don't know, but, um, yeah, so I guess over here is, um, I don't know where I should put housing, assuming, I, I mean, I'm not gonna really be here that long in, to begin with, but what kind of gym should I have, and obviously, I think I want it to face this way, and I want my house to be in the gym, but I guess a wood gym would not hurt one bit. I think that would probably be the best bet. So we can go chop down one tree because I don't want to chop down trees on camera because that's not fun for you to watch. But um, yeah, I don't know. Okay, well, that's glitchy. And uh, yeah, so right here, I guess, would be the best bet. Plus, we have kind of a lot of wood to begin with. That is, I feel like there's a sexual innuendo to be made. I'll be mature about it, don't worry. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so priority one in my book right now is getting a better, uh, this thing. This thing sucks, I don't even want to use it again. Like, it, it, it was literally five minutes I was sitting there. So what I think I'm going to do now is create a little boaty boat, and um, we can go travel over to uh, that place. Why? Oh crap, I'm going to die and lose everything. Potions should really be more abundant. Um, but again, in case you do not know, Friday at noon-ish, I will be live streaming, so you can look forward to that. And now what I started doing is, um, whoever, we're going to have a contest. I think what I'm going to do this Friday is we're going to have a contest of, uh, uh, like a championship contest. Like maybe we'll have a little tournament type thing, and I'll make a bracket, and um, I'll judge... Uh, like while people battle and that'll I'll add on to the time of the live stream hopefully and you could win a prize that way and as well as well you could win a prize by having the coolest Pokemon contest which um, we had last week and someone's baby or the the puny or puny pygmy uh, little dude what was it called uh, pygmy Bulbasaur one because it was just so cool and they won earthquake three rare candies and something else but I think what I'm gonna start doing giving is potions as well because there's really no practical way to get potions right now. So I think that is something that should be addressed. And hopefully we can address that. Or maybe I should just make an admin shop selling potions. You know what? That's a tempting idea. But um, that is something for another day, obviously. Maybe like a national Pokemart at spawn. That's a cool idea. But maybe when the next server comes out, we can do that. I should make them expensive, though. Huh. So give me guys, what do you guys think about that? If I made, like, a admin Pokemart that sold some of the potions and stuff you can't get, like, I feel like HMs and TMs are just nearly impossible to get, and it kind of sucks, so that is something I would like to address at some point. But let's see if we can't find any Pokemon here. I don't see any uh, right now, obviously. Uh, I thought that was destroyed, but it was not. And uh, yeah, so I don't see any yet. Uh, I always have so much trouble in the jungle biomes finding actual Pokemon. I don't know. I, I just, 
I'm always very unlucky, I feel like. So we can just jump around a little, look for some things. Obviously, it is not nighttime yet, so maybe the first couple we could just battle, and then the second few we can just try and kill over battle. So here, let's destroy this because it is in the way. If only I had a flying Pokemon right now. Soon we will once Charizard evolves, or Charmeleon. Imagine we find a Mew. That would be pretty crazy. Or a shiny Mew. That would be even crazier. We will probably, I will admit that, I will probably, not to be pessimistic, never, but I will, I am confident in saying I will never find a shiny Mew in my Pixelmon career. It's just, it's like what? Isn't the Mew an 8,000? Uh, I know the shiny is like an 8,001 chance. And then a Mew is another, I think, isn't even rare, is it, is a Mew rarer than a shiny, or not, I forget, but, uh, it's, it's ridiculous, okay, so, um, I was trying to be Tarzan there, and it kind of failed a little, but, uh, yeah, so I can comfortably say I will probably never find a Mew, it's okay, I admit it, and, yeah, so what we can do is continue on, and, uh, yeah, so that's always fun. We can jump around a little and see what is up. And something I was planning on doing, so I know a lot of you guys were kind of like, I feel like the server is kind of open and it's not the best, I feel like. So what I was going to do to kind of reduce things is when I update the server, I was going to add two things. One, a second world, which is way overdue. If you donate already, uh, $10 to donate, obviously, if you do slash buy, it's a shameless plug. Actually, that was kind of cheesy, but basically what I was going to add, if you donate, you get the second world kind of hopefully it'll be you know different and um, also what I was gonna do is add a plugin that would allow you to only chat on that world so obviously I would play on both worlds but maybe my main base and gym would be on the second world so that's not for people to like that's not because I want people to donate so much more that I well obviously I do want people to donate I, I'm not gonna say I don't but I would probably have like a house on one world and something else in the other or maybe like I'll have my shop on the main world and stuff like that and then um, stuff like that or my yeah or something I don't know something along those lines obviously more people are going to be on the main world than the second world but hopefully we can do something like that maybe even since we have been getting a quite a bit of donations lately uh, and if things do increase because of the second world maybe we could even expand the server a little and um, you know give it more it, it make it more stable because lately it has been today we reached uh oh tyranno's on he's never on and uh, we have we did reach a high okay that dude i could battle come on <laughs> because i can't get over there easily though no all right come on let's use our tarzan skills and climb over there so we will do a little jumping and things like that there is a uh what are those things called uh coho bean a tiny baby Coco Bean, so we can jump again using our Tarzan skills. I think I saw an actual Pokemon as well. I don't know why, but I feel like I get so unlucky compared to other people in these biomes. They just, I, like, I don't see any Pokemon, especially in when I first started. I remember in the in my first initial playthrough of this. Hello! Uh, I, I, got, I saw so many more, I feel like. So we can do Ember a bunch of times, because that's really what this guy is going to be. And now we get a crit, too. Kakuna. Alright, so you're the Cocoon, dude. As I take a drink of water, and we're just gonna hopefully sweep through all of these dudes. Pidgey, we're getting 52 experience. Obviously, that's not helping us much, cause it's not doing. Oh god. Oh, all right. No, that's impossible. Well, I do the impossible. Damn All right. <laughs> that was a little cheesy, but hopefully we can get a nice addition. Ooh. Do you think Marie? Marie doesn't actually have an electric move, so I don't think Marie could uh, battle him. And also. Uh, I, I'm gonna add Pokey Loot again when we update. Uh, that's just something else I should probably address, as uh, I'm sure lots of you guys want that back, and um, it was a good thing. The only reason I removed it was it, it didn't update in time. Like it took it updated like a few days after Pixelmon actually updated, and I didn't want to put off updating the server anymore. So there's that. But hopefully they'll keep up more on top of it, and um, yeah. So there's that. And, uh oh I saw something over there. So let's see, come on, it is nighttime now, so hopefully we can actually go catch something, and we can jump down. Ah, no! I have a Kabuto for trade. Um, I don't have anything to trade. Yeah, so I'm only going to use these Pokemon for trades right now, the ones I capture now, currently. Um, I really wish there was some more rare... Actually, I found out there was a pincer in this. 
I didn't even know that, so I thought that was awesome. I definitely want a pincer. Hopefully that's something we could try and capture. I mean, uh, same thing with like Articuno and stuff. I haven't seen, uh, I've seen a Mew. I've seen a couple Mews on here. I haven't seen a Zapdos, Articuno, or Moltres yet. So those are cool Pokemon that I would love for someone to uh, like capture. Actually, you know what we can do while we're over here? Let's go try and capture like a Swamp, or Swamp. Uh, a muck, we have a muck, uh, a coughing or something like that. Coughing is a pretty defensive Pokemon, which is good. So hopefully we could get something in a good nature, even a Grimer. I mean, well, which one? What level are you? You're 18 and you're 11. I feel like, because I feel like a Grimer could really just f stuff up, <laughs> um, fudge stuff up rather. And um, so let's capture you. And I think, yeah, just a straight battle should do us well. And a Dragon Rage, hopefully you don't die instantly. But, all right, don't kill me. Sludge, all right, that's a decent damage. Now we can go Bag, Pokeball, Dusk Ball. And again, so since it is nighttime and he is kind of weak, hopefully we'll get the capture. As I take a drink of water. So I don't know how good is a Dusk Ball at nighttime versus like an Ultra Ball or a Great Ball. I don't know, I should probably look that up. As well, I should look up natures to these guys, because I feel like that is a secret time bomb that no one takes advantage of, that I could be the one guy that takes it. Is it capturing? I can't tell. All right, yeah. So, all right, awesome. So we got a Grimer, as you can see right there. He is quite cute. And um, maybe I should just open the natures really fast right now. So let's do that. Pokemon natures, type really fast so no one gets mad. Um, all right, so I have that open in the background. We can go to stats, nature, mild. Um nature my oh my god there are so many mild speed attack defense dry De wait decrease that okay it decreases defense i imagine that grimers tend to be a pretty defensive pokemon right in other words your nature sucks so um yeah um should we go try and capture another a new one let's see where's that other one let's see what his nature is and where did the other one go? Hello, Grimers. And uh, I should probably get a Leaf Stone and try and do something with that. So hello, Grimer too. And I feel like you I'll just kill with this. I guess we could try it though. We'll see where it goes. Yep, nope, I was right. Okay. Well, we leveled up. Scary face. User frightened. Sorry, harsh reduce its speed stat. I feel like that's... I, I, I'm anti-smoke screen now because of how annoying it is. So I'm getting rid of it. And um, I, I know. So I may sound horrible for saying that because I just refuse to take advantage of people using smoke screen now. So let's go see if we can't find a new Grimer with a better nature. And actually now that I have this open, I should probably check out what Mareep is and stuff like that. Maybe even capturing a, a new Gyarados would be cool, but I don't think we could top the shiny Gyarados that we have. It's spelled Gyarados though. So am I just like saying it wrong? Gyarados? Gyarados? I don't know. I don't know. So uh, hopefully I'm saying it right. I think I am. That's how I've been. I've always said it since I was a little kid, since, you know, back in my Gen 1 days. Gyarados, Gyarados, Gyarados. I don't know, but I don't see any Pokemon. Oh, there's a... Oh, what is that thing called? I don't know. That's certainly a high-level Pokemon, though, so hopefully Charmeleon could actually do some work on him. Should we even debate catching that thing? Oh, so yeah, actually, I do see quite a bit, quite a few Pokemon over here. But that is a bug Pokemon, so that'll be kind of cool to uh, kill because I think fire is good against bug, super effective, two times damage, but you also are poison, so you're a pain in the butt in that sense, because you, uh, I was itching my nose if it sounded weird, uh, you actually, yeah, you could poison me, I think, uh, yep, <laughs> As, speak the devil, he poisons me, so, um, all right, so we should kill it, though, and there you go, so Charmeleon gaining some nice experience, and saying Charmeleon about nine times through that battle, and oh, I already have a Paris, and that is a really tiny Paris though. So let's look for a Muck, or actually no, I, I, I think I want a, uh, I think I want a new Grimer and or a Coughing. So Grimer and Coughing and or Coughing. So if I see any of those, I will be interested in catching that. And here, I'll get some of these dudes because everyone, no one ever really, the Leaf Stones are so easy. Oh crap, I'm not gonna make that jump. So let's, uh, let's be cheesy and uh, break a block like the babies we are on the inside. And we can break you and get a little shard there, as you did see. And then we could jump into the water so graciously. Selling four string for one Pokeball. 
Wow, that is, that's how you know times are tough, when people start selling four string for one Pokeball. And this is probably, oh look, there is one. Is that a coughing or, no, that's uh, that's the evolution. And what is that, that's another Venomot, so we could go battle you. And luckily, I don't think I'm poisoned anymore. Oh no, oh no, it's becoming daytime, no, no, stay nighttime, I'm not gonna be, alright, just go, dust ball, dust ball. This is up for you, or up to you. It's dusk, and, are you, what the, what? What the hell, dust ball? <laughs> you just <laughs> why'd you break? I threw it at him. I must have hit a tree or something. Well, uh, you know what? I'm just gonna stop talking. Come on, man, pull through for me. But no, wheezing, wheezing. I'm gonna try again, and then if this one doesn't work, I will give up, and I will travel back home. And uh, hopefully, we can go out with a bang though. I mean, we did find one Grimer. That is good. Come on. No, God damn it. All right. Oh well, it happens. So, uh, let's see, where was, who else did I, where's that dude I wanted to battle? So now I'm finding more bug Pokemon in the forest than uh, anywhere else, so there's that. Actually, should I battle you and just go for it? Uh, level 35, so we could paralyze you with Mareep. And, oh, okay, what happened there? Oh, it's save complete, so Mareep come back. Mareep battle this mother fudger, and um, we can do a thunder wave, so let's see. Sleep pad, okay, or you could be a little bit faster and do that, so I am sleeping now. Do I continue to stay in? I mean, I feel like Mareep is a lost cause, okay. Mareep, wake up, Mareep, damn it, Mareep, wake up. Oh god, uh, yep, this is bad, this is bad news bears. Worst case scenario right here, if we get a burn, we may get lucky. Okay, we got burn. <laughs> we got burnt, we didn't get a burn though. So, stun sport, alright, he missed. Dragon Rage didn't do much. Ember could, I mean, if we're super duper, okay. Okay, Grimer, pull through for me, buddy. And, okay, Grimer didn't even get a chance to battle. So, that is how you die. And we could do th slash T spawn and teleport back to the spawn of my town. So what I will do now, and I'm sure this will be kind of controversial. Actually, here, look, so I actually have a muck. Just out of curiosity, what nature is the muck so we go to stats he is brave which i imagine is pretty good attack increase stat is attack decrease that speed and see that's not even that bad honestly because I, I don't think you have high attack i imagine you have high defense no you do have really high attack huh so you're actually not that bad of a pokemon i should have used you in the sludge bomb wow you even got a decent move mud bomb i don't know about that one but uh yeah so too bad i'm not using you you are a cool pokemon and there is my charizard where's my starter eevee i don't know and also some people told me to get a sand dial so i'll go catch a new one of those but we could throw muck in here and why can't i release it yep there goes muck so um he is gonzo because he's not the best pokemon and i don't want him so we could do that and, uh, what, what the, what the hell, um, what are they saying? Why are they speaking a different language? Raise your dongers, raise your dongers. Anyone have a tip for a rookie at Pixelmon? Find food. Um, yep, that's my tip for a rookie, because you never realize you're going to run out until you're gone, or until it's all gone. So, I, I guess, um, hmm, I, oh, okay, okay. You want a mess, man? You want a mess? Tell your friends. Tell your friends. And, alright. So everyone said my name. I don't know if there is a follow-up to saying my name, or if it's just say my name, and uh, make yourself, your presence known. So, there's a Pidgey. A level 2 Pidgey at it. Or at that. So, that's tempting to catch, but I will continue getting these um, Leafstone shards. How many do we have? It. <gasps> I want you. I want you. I don't care. Um... Oh, I'm not getting another Kadabra, though. Screw you, Kadabra. Honestly, you just, you, you were a bad experience the first time around. And um, I'll just say hi. Because I'm not really paying attention to that. So there's Prime Apes here. Actually, oh, how did I faint? What? What? When did that happen? Wait, what? Seriously, when the... <laughs> um, oh my god, I heart that name. Oh, well, that's good. So... Let's see, Skyrim boss. So, what we can do is go uh, do work. Maybe we'll open with Mareep, and then we'll attack with Charmeleon. So, hopefully, Mareep can get some experience out of that. And he could, uh, Mareep will hopefully be able to paralyze him. So, there is that. And so, yeah, let's run over here. We'll eat some meat. Actually, I'm going to have to find a better source of food shortly, because 
but that is going to be a problem. So Primeape, let's go two of my Pokemon against yourself, fighting Mother Fudger, and um, yeah, so let's see how this goes. Primeape is paralyzed. I don't have, think any of these other moves are really good, so we'll switch into Charmeleon, who does have some good moves like Dragon Rage, and uh, so we, we were faster than him. Huh, well, that's good. Oh yeah, I gotta. I keep forgetting. I have to check my two Pokemon's uh, thing. So oh yes, yeah, so that'll kill him in two hits. That's good. So we are faster. Luckily now, I don't think uh, my Charizard is or my shiny Charmeleon is that fast. So yeah, as you can see, he leveled up twice. What? Uh, okay, I'll just, I'll forget that one. <laughs> wow, you leveled a lot, both of you, uh, so that's good. And let's see, is there another one of those guys? Because they obviously give good experience. So we can switch back into Flaffy, and after I battle you, I will check what his nature is. And, alright, so, we can do the exact same thing, look at me, Mr. Pigman. And, oh, this one's fast, this one's, yeah, this one's much faster. So we can go switch back out into Charmeleon, oh god, he might kill me. Don't kill me, Fury Swipes, Mother Fudger. Um, Dragon Rage again, I guess. Uh, Juice did what? I don't know, they're talking about me now. This is bad. This is very bad. All right, so we should be faster because he is paralyzed, having your speed, and there you go. So Flaffy is growing up again, and yeah, so everyone leveled up a bunch of times. Too bad we didn't find a new Pokemon, but we did get a whole bunch of new stuff, and I'm really tempted to capture you right now, and there's a Lapras. I'm not going to capture a Lapras this time. I really want to capture that dude, actually, but I think I want to start with a lower level first evolution. You know what? Screw it. You know what? Yeah, we're going to go capture you. I don't care if I have a Dusk Ball. And only one. Um, yeah, we'll open up a Flaffy and paralyze you. And then, uh, don't kill me, please. And then, yeah, we'll hopefully find a Moonstone along the way. Okay, I'm poisoned. Thunder Wave. He's paralyzed. I'm hurt by poison. Flaffy's gonna die, so we'll switch out. He's like death fodder now, even though there's only two Pokemon, so switching into him will just really screw me. And a Dragon Rage should do enough damage to not kill. Yeah, perfect. Okay, then. Uh, wait, what? Do crits work on Dragon Rage? Someone tell me in the comments below. If I get a crit on a move that only does 40 damage, does that make it do 60 damage? 60 HP? I, I don't know. What? I, like, how does that work? I don't know. Okay, so what we can do is continue on. So waiting. Damn it! Alright, there goes all the Pokeballs. Alright, well, I guess that's not happening. So we can do another Dragon Rage just to finish him off and move on. Okay, there you go. So... There you go. Good job, Charmeleon. Oh, what? Hello. Um, yeah, and then we can go heal up. But first, let's check the natures of these two beasts. So if we go to stats, nature naive. What is that? That sounds bad. Naive, it increased stat speed, decreased stat speed defense. Actually, that's pretty good. But you're slow still. 52 speed. Oh, yeah. Well, that's actually not that bad, I guess. Because your speed is good for like a main sweeper Pokemon. You're relaxed. What's that? Relaxed. Increase stat defense. So that's actually pretty good too. Defense. No, your defense kind of stuck. So it would have been better if it's speed attack because you're electric. So Or special attack, rather. Because, again, you're electric. As I take my drink of water to do my outro, I thank you all for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. We have wasted five pokey thing. Okay. We have wasted a whole bunch of pokeballs. I thank you for watching. And I hope to see you all next time. Bye. I hit the wrong button.